Hello and welcome to the C Sharp 8 and .NET Core 3.1 Recipes course by Pact Publishing. I am Dimitris Lukas and I will be guiding you through a series of recipes that will help you improve your .NET Core skills, refresh and update your C Sharp skills in real life scenarios. In this video I will present you the course material and everything you need to know to prepare for future videos. We will begin by studying the latest features in C Sharp 8. Moving on, we will apply the new features in handling collections and data. That will allow us to move forward with some of the most advanced C Sharp features like event handling, lambda expressions and multi-threading. After that, we will build a database-driven application using the ORM of choice for .NET apps, Entity Framework Core. With a database layer in place, we will be able to build a RESTful API with ASP.NET Core and then later use Razor Pages, Blazor and compile c -sharp to WebAssembly. We will finish this course with desktop apps and WPF. Before you start this course, it is very important to have some knowledge of c -sharp, to have worked with .NET Core in the past, especially along with Entity Framework Core. This course takes the basics for granted and moves on to advanced concepts and new C-sharp features. In this course we will also use some HTML, CSS and JavaScript. You can view this course and follow the examples in a computer running Windows and the latest version of Visual Studio. After finishing this course you will be able to leverage all new C-sharp 7 features to improve the quality of your code. Build a database driven application with the most widely used ORM with .NET Core and of course build WebAssembly apps with c -sharp and Blazor as well as desktop apps with WPF. So let's get right into it.